Perfect. Perfect. Welcome back to Kevin Fitness Seekers. Now today we'll be doing our sliding disc routine outdoor edition. Now we did a workout previously, but it was considered more of an indoor version. You can catch the link in the card above, or you can check it out in the description below. Now as far as the equipment that we're using, we'll be using the Skills sliding disc that we also did a product review. You can catch that also in the cards above and also in the link below. Now today's workout, we'll be focusing on the core, the upper abdominals, lower abdominals, and getting a little obliques in there. And also supplementary, we'll be hitting the chest, the arms, shoulders, and some legs and lower back. This routine has six intervals. In this video, we will be doing only interval one. Doing intervals one and two, each exercise is done for 30 seconds with a 45 second break after each interval. During intervals three and four, each exercise is done for 15 seconds with a 30 second rest between each interval. Once you reach interval five and six, each exercise is done for 10 seconds with no rest between each interval. If you're doing this routine as a solo workout, you should extend the interval time or increase the number of seconds that you hold each exercise. Make sure you drink lots of water, make sure you stretch, and bring all the motivation you have. This is our sliding disc routine outdoor edition. Plank to pike. Start in a high plank, hands shoulder width apart, or wider if that's how you usually do your push ups. Your toes should be on disc. Engage your core and slide both feet toward your hands, pushing your butt towards the ceiling. Try to keep your legs as straight as possible. But if your hamstrings are tight, you may need to bend your knees a bit. Pause and then slowly return to the start and that's one rep. This exercise targets the abdominals, chest, and shoulder muscles. Plank Jack. Start in a high plank. Hands should be shoulder width apart. With your toes on the disc, core and glutes engaged, slide your feet out and in. Keep your core and glutes really tight and try not to let your butt and hips bounce. Move faster for a bigger cardio challenge. If you have trouble maintaining form, slow down. This exercise targets the upper and lower abdominals. Reverse Plank Pulse. From a sitting position with your hands palm down on the ground, shoulder width apart with your heels on disc, you want to push and lift your body until it forms a straight line. While keeping your abdominals contracted, you want to pause for five to 10 seconds and then return to the starting position and repeat. This exercise targets the muscles in your hamstrings, glutes, abs, and especially your lower back. Plank knee tuck twist. Start in a high plank position with your hands shoulder width apart or wide if you prefer. Your toes should be on disc, engage your core, and slowly bring your knees diagonally underneath your body towards your right arm. Pause, then slowly return to the starting position. Repeat for the left side and that's one rep. This exercise targets the hamstrings, abdominals, and oblique muscles. Body saw, start in a forearm plank. Elbows directly under your shoulders, and arms parallel to the ground. With your toes on the disc, tuck your tailbone and engage your quads. Slowly push your forearms and elbows to slide yourself as far back as you can without losing core engagement. Don't let your hips sag. You want to slowly pull yourself back to the start position to make that one rep. This exercise targets the lower back, hamstrings, glutes, quads, and abdominals with obliques. Thank you. 
and this was our sliding disc routine outdoor edition now if you have any questions or comments you can hit us up in the comment section below or you can hit us up on one of our social media platforms that's on instagram and facebook that's at casual fitness seekers and if you have twitter you can now hit us up on twitter that's at casual fitness s1 now if you enjoyed the video make sure you hit that thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on any upcoming content that should be floating around by around this area forget to hit that bell so that you get notified whenever we post casual fitness seekers out <laughs>